got most of our packages in. Uh, now it's kind of situational football. I think we have the guys in the right spots as we start the season. I think guys are getting to know their role, the role they'll have on our football team. Good work, offense, good job finishing plays today. Pleased with, you know, our new guys coming in. Brandon Peters, uh, average, you know, he's good as advertised throwing the football. So just like where we are, good competition. Any update on Marquez? You, you guys saw him, right? On crutches, that's about it. I mean, you can tell he has a significant uh, knee injury, so that's about where we are right now. Do you expect him to be ready for week one? I have no idea. He got a significant knee injury, he's not practicing right now. If it gets to a point where there's something definite that we need to tell you, we will then until, until the end. Coach, you look at what Brandon Peters has done, has kind of made this offense his own. Has he kind of established himself as the guy, or is that still competition? No, it's definitely still competition. We hadn't named any permanent starters, anything like that. But just watching practice, you, I mean, you notice uh, he's been everything. Uh, he wanted to be as, aver as good as advertised, throw the football, really getting comfortable in the offense. He's getting comfortable just being a, a new teammate. You know, as far as the quarterback concerned, you just can't blend in. You got to come in, and they listen to you every snap. And uh, I see him growing each day in that role. How impressed have you been with Daniel Barker's improvement from freshman to sophomore year? Daniel's been a good football player since he's gotten here. The more, of course, second year round, he's feeling more comfortable in the offense, making plays. And uh, again, his personality—he doesn't need a pep talk ever. <laughs> uh, and, you know, Daniel, it's okay. I mean, you can play. That's not a part of his DNA, but uh, he's making plays. He's a good football player. And you mentioned the offense having a pretty strong practice, especially the finish. Mm -hmm. What does that mean for the defense today? Uh, they didn't play as well as the offense. Kind of uh, simple as that. The University of Illinois is going to have a good day each day. And I think if you go back into practice and watch the video, you're going to like some good things that are done on both sides. But um, I'm going to concentrate more as a head football coach love what the offense was able to do. We're going to be in two-minute situation uh, where we need to score a touchdown, and uh, they were able to get it in the end zone. Did you like the energy that the offense had just with that? I mean, like, everything, like everything that happened today with our football team. It's a good practice. These are the practices we've been, uh, we've been having. Energy can, can mislead you sometimes. It's how are they practicing. We practice hard today.